All right, now in physics, whenever you do a measurement, it is very important to put in your measurement uncertainty. So all values, okay, will have a measured value, and then you have to put in your uncertainty. So this is the what we call the measured value, okay, and this is what we call the absolute uncertainty. So for example, if you're taking a length reading, this could be, let's say, for example, 9.8 centimeters, okay, and this, for example, could be plus minus 0 0.1 centimeters. So this tells you that you are confident that your measured value is between 9.7 to 9.9, .9, but beyond that, okay, you're not really quite sure. Okay, it could be anything between 9.7 to 9.9 .9, based on the accuracy of your instrument. Okay, it's very important to put this when you take your measurements. Now, there's another type of error. This can be called your fractional error, okay, or it can be called your percentage error. And this is simply taking the absolute divided by the measured value. So in this case, right, oh, usually we call this delta x and x, yeah? So the, the fractional, uh, fractional or percentage uncertainty is simply delta x over x. So in this case, that would be 0 0.1 over 9.8.